welcome to Sanka Pup Designs, a peek into Kangas pouch. Okay, so Hugh here likes really cute knitting things, like really adorably cute. Okay, you in the back, you probably need to raise your hand because I am sure you will love this. This is um, a special treat from Tiny Owl Knits, the Hexapuff. Look, isn't that just so cute? And um, so this is Tiny Owl Knits' newest um, knit, or I assume it's her newest knitting uh, knitting pattern that she has out. And um, and so I've started knitting on it, and that's what I've been working on lately. I have this is just a sample. This is the real um, the real size of the Hexapuff. This is um, fingering weight and um, some sock needles, and it is knit on. Um, on three sock needles or you can also knit it with magic loop to be honest I prefer magic loop even though I'm a big double pointed needle fan and I use it for all my socks magic loop just seems so much easier to me and it it makes it easier to get the nice and um, even edge without having to pull tremendously and so um, this is the sample that I knit up and this is the actual size of the if you knit it at the pattern now what I did is it has, um, I added an extra row if you look at the pattern in um, before like halfway through the pattern I add an extra increase row and I also add an extra decrease row at the second half and that just makes it a, a, a tad bit larger or a tad bit um, taller because I just thought that it looked like a, like a bit more um, even and so uh, this is the sample that I knit of the actual size and the quilt that I'm working on or the blanket is actually has this big now you can see a huge difference between this and this to be honest after I knit this one up I kind of wish that I would have started small because these are so adorable but um but I kind of wanted something a bit faster and something that I could use up yarn that I already had so um so this is my hexapuff and I have here a bucket with all this is going to be my hexapuff bucket and so I have um, some of them that aren't finished yet I, they still need stuffing and now with this pattern you have the option you can either stuff it like this which I think it adds a nice little squish or you can have it flat which um, which it looks fine flat although I like the squishiness so um, this is the jumbo size hexapuff and so as you can see in my pouch. These are the um, the large size hexapuffs, monster puffs if you want, um, on my uh, circular needle. And this this one I'm you with this quilt I'm using Lion Brand Homespun and um, it's just something that I had a lot of that I could use quickly without having to wait to collect all the little scraps but I am thankful our one neat thing that I really like about this is that you can use up your old sock yarn scraps and which is a huge thing for me because I am a big sock knitter and so I um, I can use up all my sock scraps and they just are so adorable look at that that is just so cute and it just when you see it, it just makes you want to knit one up right away and knit just a whole army of hexapuffs. So, uh, I suggest you whip out your sock scraps and get knitting because once you are in this project, you will not want to stop knitting. They are so cute and they feel like a little accomplishment within each one, which is why I particularly like this. And also, they're travel size, so you can take them anywhere. Say if you're going to a sports game and you have to, um, you know, if you're if you're like me and you have to keep your hands busy while you're watching something or uh, while watching a movie with your family you know if you can if you're good at knitting without looking at your knitting then uh, you can do those while um, you can knit while you're watching a movie and pretty soon you'll be churning out these things and then you will have a whole blanket of hexapuffs and uh, yeah it won't take as long as I don't know once you get addicted to the little hexapuffs, then it's not going to take long at all. So I, this is a pattern that I highly recommend that I've um, that has brought a lot of enjoyment. And so, um, well, have fun with your hexapuffs.